we had an equipment malfunction, so we're going to finish where we were. We're talking about if you feed, feed part of your meal in the bowl or all of your meal in the bowl. And the reason you don't want her to take it until you give her the cue is you want to help build more self-control. I always use the word impulse control, but self-control. You can set the bowl down. She makes a move for it. You just cover it when she backs away. Makes a choice on her own. That's why the name of it is It's Your Choice. You can feed her out of it. She knows I have other treats in my other hand, so she doesn't want her kibble, her dinner. See, I dropped it. She see her leave it after I dropped it. The game is working. She knows I have a different treat in the other hand. That's why she didn't want her kibble. So when we're doing the It's Your Choice game, it's a cheesy treat, so she's going to want it more. And a lot of the reason you play this game is you're not at home to say, get it. You're, the reason you're not telling her leave it, uh -uh, no bad dog, the, anything like that when it comes to it is you're not going to be at home at some point and you're going to have something on the counter and she's going to say, I want it. You want her to make the choice on her own to not get it because you're not going to be at home to say, leave it, don't, no, no, uh -uh. and if you've taught her self-control and impulse control, she's not going to have the desire to go in there and take something off the counter or even... For instance, if you get this game strong enough and you drop medication on the floor, which we had happen last night at PetSmart, we found a pill on the floor at PetSmart, and a dog walked up and sniffed it. Luckily, he did not eat it. We looked around. We did find another pill. We don't know if it was a purpose there, but that dog could have eaten it, and it could have killed the dog. And if the dog makes a choice and has self-control and doesn't eat something like that, it could save your dog's life by having impulse control and self-control. And she is not making a move, and this is a higher value treat, and you can see she's not making a move for it. You practice this game every day, short sessions, one to five minutes. You play it one to five minutes. Uh, you do it every day, as often as you can. If you don't have time, you just keep out five or six, seven, eight, ten morsels of her food and play this game with it. You'll, you do it with her food bowl. You do it with anything that you, you what your, your ultimate goal is, you don't want her to put anything in her mouth that you haven't said the word, get it. Good girl. You're so smart. You're so smart. Your mommy's gonna be so proud. Yes, your mommy's gonna be so proud. You ready to move on to another one?